a TikTok user with Parkinson's once posted a video expressing anger over how tiny the pills for treating Parkinson's were because it makes them really difficult to pick up. Four days later, a guy who directs country music videos for a living and is famous on TikTok for knowing obscure facts about Snapple taught himself how to use Fusion 360, which is a design and modeling tool so he could design a pill bottle that solves the problem. Now, the problem was that he didn't own a 3D printer, so he posted a video of his design and offered to share schematics with anyone who wanted to test it and or improve upon it. All schematics are open source. A day later, dozens of engineers and 3D printer enthusiasts had begun working on the project and started refining and tweaking to get tolerances where they needed to be and ensuring that it actually met the needs of those it was being designed for. In less than 24 hours, finally, a working prototype was developed. The original designer got a patent attorney to ensure it remains open source and the patent itself was donated to a foundation. Also, for anyone who needed one urgently and cannot wait until the manufacturing and scale begins, they could get one at cost directly from the engineers printing them at home. We are indeed living in a brave new world. And this is an incredible example of the society coming together and work, not out of greed for money, but to help others for purely altruistic reasons. May we always demonstrate our love by being compassionate and caring towards those we encounter here on earth. The Bible reminds us, don't forget to do good and to share what you have because God is pleased with these kinds of sacrifices.